I'm here with Chris on the daiquiri boot at Hanover Mesa. Chris, what are you up to daiquiri these days? Well, daiquiri is all about industrial wearables. Uh, we focus with, on our customers with something we call WorkSense. Right. Back on the wall behind me there, there's the uh, products that represent tasks that you do every day in industrial situations like out in the field or in the auto factory or in the maintenance line. But WorkSense helps you get, get the job done with digital tools. Uh, one of the things that we're celebrating here is the release of a product from our uh, one of our key customers called Fabio Perini. Right. They've actually released WorkSense under their own label, so we uh, ah. actually work as an OEM, which is a bit bit novel in this industry. The Fabio Perini uh, uh, headset and glasses help their customers deliver customer service whenever they need it around the world. They uh, they focus on converting tissue and and producing paper products um, with their with their really incredible sophisticated machines. Our glasses help them bring their customers closer to their technicians and closer to their data. So it's pretty exciting to announce the release so, of that so product. So they're doing that to enable their own That's right. repair, maintenance, predictive, That's right. whatever. That's right. They ship, they ship WorkSense right alongside their machines. They uh, provide a new type of a channel to their customers, and they get to have a better, closer relationship. And so that's something that we're promoting, this, this OEM white label concept, all, right. uh, all built on the standard WorkSense stack. And for a company um, like Fabio Perini, how, how do they how do they start on that journey? Yeah, it's it's pretty simple. We have uh, five built-in apps to this product we call WorkSense that allow you to start with something like simple, like a remote um, a remote expert scenario. Okay. We might have a remote call that's called Show. You might uh, also want to add some work instructions, and we do that with something called Guide. So when you put on the glasses, it, it tells you what's available to you, yep. and you can just access the content uh, anywhere you are in the world. We have something called Tag, which spatially locates information uh, at uh, the point of work. It might tell you there's a data problem that you have to check on, or it might have to tell you that there's some training you need to get done. Right. But these are all things that you put on the glasses, you just simply look to find what you need to, to do in your workday, and it'll give you help on all those tasks. Wow. And in terms of what's coming down the line from Daiquiri in the next couple of months, anything new or yeah, we're more always working on something new. Yeah, we're already uh, one of the most sophisticated devices uh, out there. This is a, a lightweight headset. We're going to keep working on uh, hardware design, of course, but something really important for our enterprise customers: we do on-premise installations in, or cloud. Okay. So we give customers that choice of rolling out uh, entirely hosted by us, yep. and something that you take the glass out in the field and they just work. Or if you want to do some sophisticated integration, uh, some of our government contractor customers or they our, maybe want to put yeah, their own or our automakers place. or pharmaceuticals, they like to have it uh, on prem. So Chris, as you work with more and more industrial customers, are the use cases for augmented reality, are they the same? Are people, are they evolving? What's going on there? Yeah, we're here at Hanover and industrial use cases are all we do. So we focus very heavily on how people relate to assets better. Okay. It could be a robot, it could be a piece of process manufacturing equipment, it could be a a, um, a bottling uh, uh, facility. How people work and interact with their physical environment is what we do, and in, in that world you find things like uh, maintenance, uh, yep. incident management, uh, training, collaboration, uh, assembly, uh, plotting of new uh, environments. That's what we do, and, and we've aligned our apps with those tasks. So those those tasks uh, are, are built into the, the glasses. You can do all those types of functions with just an out-of-the-box experience. But one of the things that we do pretty uniquely is we work with partners too. Yep. Uh, here at this handout, you'll see us in the booth with SAP, working through the end-to-end -end manufacturing process, the end-to-end -end operating process. Similarly, uh, Amazon Web Services, we're the only industrial uh, software partner that Amazon has for a wearable. Uh, okay. Yeah, so the AWS experience all the way through a pair of glasses is, uh, is a very natural one for somebody who's thinking about how do I get my IoT data out to somebody in the field who might need to do some maintenance work. So that's a pretty exciting uh, trend that we see is working with some of these major players to bring this to people all over the world. Hey, I wish you well. Thank you. Thank you. Thanks. Thank you.